Come on, Izzy girl, let's go. We're going hiking. We're going on an adventure. Stefan Keith and his best pal Izzy, that's short for Isadora Diamond Dubinsky, have hiked summits throughout New England. Wanna go swimming? Wanna go swimming? Come on. The Chinook Husky mix is five years old and has never suffered an injury on the trails, but it's been known to happen to other people who take their dog hiking. You know, I got a, I got a 90 pound dog. If something happened to my dog, you know, I couldn't leave her behind. And then to, you know, try to carry her, I mean, I, j I just couldn't do it. So Stefan invented this. You're doing good, Izzy. Turning to a seamstress for help. I had a piece of fabric, you know, uh, kind of picture drawn how I wanted it and just talked to her and she says she could help me out. We didn't know how it would be, but she'd help me out. Stefan's friends realized he was onto something and they urged him to market the harness to the public. I found a manufacturer in Nashua. It's Ridgeview Manufacturing. And it's a whole lot easier to pull yourself up. After several prototypes, Packapaw Rescue Harness was finished. It's a real simple design, very lightweight. You lay it out, these large holes for her back paws and the smaller, smaller holes her front paws go in. And I get her, get her right in it. it takes a minute. The nylon can hold up to 400 pounds. The harness buckles in front with straps you can wrap around your chest. And you can carry the dog on your back or in the front. And you can adjust the dog higher on your back or lower. But once I get her, I kind of lean her forward just so she gets the feel of being off. I get one knee under me, stay. And then I just stand her up. But it gives me my hands free so I can use my hiking poles. If she gets heavy, I can lean forward. If I have a backpack I need to carry, a lot of hunters use this. You can carry your gun, your gear. If your dog gets hurt out hunting, and then you can just walk her. From concept, uh, you know, through the prototypes right to the finished product, it's 100% New Hampshire. Uh, and I'm really proud of that. It's pretty simple, but it works. You know, it's just, it's perfect, you know. And not only for an emergency, if, if you hike in the White Mountains, there's some really steep ledges. Um, Cannon Mountain has some, some uh, the High Canyon Trail has a really steep ladder and there's no way to bushwhack it around. So I've had Izzy in that just to climb the ladder, you know, to get her up there so we didn't have to go all the way back down and we could get that summit. Thanks to social media and online sales, Stefan is selling the pack pod to dog owners all over the world. Recently, a hiker in Utah credited the harness with saving her German Shepherd's life while the two were hiking on a hot summer day. Stefan's day job is building homes with his brother. He never thought he would become an entrepreneur. And I'm an avid hiker, and uh, I never thought I'd do anything but, but swing that hammer with my brother. And so for all this to happen, I mean, it's, it's, it's exciting, you know? It's, like, it's the American dream, you know? It's, it's alive, it's, it's very exciting. From heartfelt to high tech, feeding your dog. Pie, are you hungry? Pie, are you hungry? And walking your dog. Let's go. Good girl, Pie. Pie here. Good girl. There is an app for that with the WAGS Explore Smart Collar. I have our invisible leash on right now. Um, as you can see, she's not going too far. If she does go a little out of range like she is right now, I can just hit the correction. Pie here. And she comes back. Good girl, Pi, good girl. An invisible leash. You don't need a leash to walk your dog anymore. Your phone is your leash. Plus, a smart way to feed your dog. The collar allows this dog feeder to dispense the right amount of food for your dog's size. The concept was like the wireless world for dogs. Terry Anderton is the founder of WAGS, a company based in Portsmouth. Come here, Daisy. Come here, Abby. The centerpiece of WAGS right. is the Explore Smart Collar with Bluetooth technology. It has a number of features. It tracks your pet's location inside or outside the home and keeps them near you while you're out walking. Using GPS tracking and customized geofencing, it's an alternative to the electronic fence. The first collar we um, built with humane vibration and ultrasonic, and what we found when we started consulting with local veterinarians and, and different people and trainers is that vibration and ultrasonic can be just as effective as shock.
and yet it's a lot more humane. Terry developed the concept out of a love for the family dog, Abby. Spooked by fireworks several years ago, Abby bolted from a party and went missing for five days. It was a lot of uh, heartache for my children. They were really sad. And I realized that, um, you know, I made a promise to them that I would make sure that it would never happen again. We've extended the, the line to include a pet feeder that works in conjunction with the dog collar, takes the data off the dog collar, feeds the dog the right amount of food. Um, we've created a dog door. The dog door allows the dog to enter and exit the home, and it's all tied together. WAGS also acquired a company called Petsy. Petsy's star attraction is a Wi-Fi pet camera and treat dispenser, allowing the dog owner to give their dog a treat and watch them without having to be at home to do it. Um, we're able to dispense treats, speak, and notify our pets that we are about to give them a treat as well as take photos um, and share them on the Petsy social website. One app controls every device we make, so you don't have multiple apps for multiple devices. WAG's products are also tied to Amazon's virtual assistant, Alexa. You can ask Alexa, Alexa, how did my dog do today? And Alexa can say, your dog did great. It ate 400 calories at nine. Smart products for dogs. It's the next generation of ensuring your dog's health and safety. Our whole goal is to make a dog's life better.